Well, a new study conducted by a nonprofit advocating for gun control shows Illinois ranks fifth in the country in homicides among black people, and 90% of those victims were killed by gun violence. WGEM Capitol Bureau reporter Ali Rasper is live in Springfield tonight with details on what advocates are asking lawmakers to do about this. Allie? Dylan and McKenzie, good evening. Democrats have pushed for several proposals for gun reform in the state this year to try and find a solution to that problem. And one of those plans would increase restrictions for gun owners by requiring fingerprints and increasing background checks. A gun violence survivor who lost both his brother and cousin in a shooting argued lawmakers need to pass this kind of legislation to help save black children and teens in Illinois. He says the consequences of lawmakers not taking action will lead to more families losing their loved ones. The young black children in communities like mine are waiting to be able to go outside without fear of being shot. These children are waiting to see what classmates they will have to bury during the school year. These families are waiting to see whose funeral they will have to attend next. Trayvon Bosley asked why state leaders took immediate action to help prevent Illinoisans dying from COVID-19. Yet, when it comes to people dying from gun violence, no action is taken. Both versions of this bill are currently stuck in committee, and we will now find out what happens after that. For now, reporting live in Springfield, Allie Rasper, WGEM News.